around street activities and expected them not to snitch. That's their fault. Yeah, but at the same time, with it as well, they weren't on their square either. Yeah, you get what I'm saying? That's their fault. They, they, they have to take accountability yeah. for that as well. Because yeah. you should know what you let a certain person see. And you should mm. also know with the notoriety that Takashi has, there's, 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 there's going to be heat on you. How could they not expect investigations to start happening? <laughs> How can you go to... What was it? The square they shot up? Like, was it the square they the shot w up in New York? Hotel. Dude, yo. That, you know, when you... Like, I think, in all honesty... And then talk on phones after about it and that. That's... Like, I don't know. Like, niggas in England are different. I, you know what I'm saying? I assume. Let's just put it this way. I assume niggas in England are different because um, that... For me, like that's like going to Oxford Circus, yeah? Yeah. And just ringing off a shot above Night Town, yeah? And still walking about people, the streets, and everybody on the internet knows They'll it They'll call that you. terrorism. And armed Bam. feds will be out there ASAP. Bam. ASAP. Bam. Bam. Listen, I, I just, I don't, I think that's how out of control they were. Hmm. But I think the biggest mistake they made in this entire thing, you know that record exec son when Shotty went after my guy? Yeah. You see those guys are some powerful motherfuckers. Lucian Beyond Grange, all... I think his name was. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah. That was that motherfucker's biggest mistake. That's when you short saw shit flip. Yeah. And then before you know it, police are down on this, blah, blah. Them motherfuckers, them dudes, they are con some connected motherfuckers. Like big facts. Yeah. You know, I, I just I just I just think. They in that situation, like they all lost it. Yeah. And now Takashi is back. Like he's the biggest thing in the world right now. Mm. He's the biggest artist in the world right now. Like, is it you can't you can't dispute? He has more eyes on him than any, the counter on YouTube. You were like, no, it's on 700. What was it? It was on 200 475 at the moment. Uh, 472. Yeah, you got and what I'm saying? Then, and I was like, the yeah. counter stopped well before that. Mm. And we realized it had broken. Mm. And so Five million an hour or something like that. Bro, like the numbers like and the bags probably being thrown at him right now are fucking ridiculous. But my only thing is the moment he stops being valuable to the people that he's valuable to. And They'll that is when away. you said, hmm. yo, and that is like, that is it, in it? It's like the moment he stops. It's tough, bro, because, you know, you said, how long do you think it's going to last? And as long as he's valuable. Do you get what I'm saying? As long as he's valuable, they will protect protect their investment. You know what I'm saying? Do you know what's mad this, though? Mm. So there was a video of academics. And academics needs to be careful as well because he'll become a target in this. Mm. But mm. there was a video of him talking about how much 6 9 has made. And he said the 20 million number. And then he went mm. on to say that uh, he hasn't splashed out on certain things. And then I get into mm. the live and I see four Richard Millies I'm sure they're mini each or something <laughs> like that. I see mad chains that he said the chain was 1.6, yeah? He's saying mm -hmm. he's got a Ventador, a Wraith. Mm. He's got mm. all of these cars. And I'm thinking... Real, real, nah, real talk, G. I, I, I'll break something down to you. I bet you they've been gifting him that shit. I'll bet you money. It's possible. It's very, very, mm. very possible. But then that goes against what he said. Oh, this is all paid for. Da, 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 like... I, mm. I mean, Takashi, you can't really believe what comes out of his mouth. He kind of because he's yeah, yeah. This this yeah. is this is one other thing. When we're talking mm. about the fucking the baby mom kidnapping, beating the shit out, of, is it true? Ooh. That's one thing I was thinking. Of. Is it true? Because a man Ooh. will lie to get himself, or he will say certain things to get himself out of trouble. So can you well, trust well, the credibility of yeah my man's words? Can you trust that? Yeah. Credibility uh, on a street level, we know that's sh shot to shit. You know, that exactly. credibility is, is, is done, man. Um, but people will fuck people like it's so hard because in this new generation, they're not growing up in a two pack era. We're, we're growing up under internet rules. Yeah. So they don't give a fuck about like there's there's people in the comments, nah, but you know, he's gonna make money and like he the will. way you make your money is, yeah, yeah, but the way you make your money as a man, like, like, yo. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I get you. I you get pick you. a side. Pick a side. Even if you, even if you're not down with a gangster shit anymore, or you, that team fucked you over. 
Yeah, pick a side, move somewhere else and, and fuck with some other people. You got what I'm saying? Talk to some other connected. Yeah. I got a question. Smart. What do you think about Meek on Twitter talking about it? Did you see all of that? Yeah. Um, What's your thoughts on that? I think Meek should stay out of it because Takashi will embarrass him. Um, I, real talk. I think Takashi will embarrass him, bro. Like, it, it shouldn't come from Takashi. If Takashi decides to start getting on live and getting lippy to Meek, like, it's just, L- yeah. Meek, Meek don't get the internet yet. <laughs> nah, you should nah, be a you should be an old man with morals on the internet. And it doesn't work like that at all, bro. The, the mor- think, morals um, don't mean nothing on the internet, mm-hmm. which I is think why our mentions. Yeah, go on. Nah, so like, why why you come off the internet yesterday, <laughs> bro? Bro, you know that last message you sent me? Yeah, I read it. I was just like, man said you sound defeated. I, I didn't even reply. I was just like, at that point, bro, I was just like, I've had enough. What's going on? <laughs> like, yo, what is going on, bro? Like, it's like the world, the realization really came to light yesterday that the world doesn't give a fuck. You can do what you want. Like, the internet has forever changed the world. It's changed people's mentalities. It's changed. Like, there's no more, there's no more of that good fella era, my guy. Like, you know, if you snitch, if you there's not that's done. That's movies, bro. We're in real life and, you know, man can be an artist, the biggest artist in the world, talk gangster shit, <laughs> and then go and sit in the dock and be like, you, you, he did it. He did it, you're on. <laughs> hey, listen. <laughs> what, what? Yo, what's happened? What's, what's happened? happened? What's happened, boy? Bro. You know, and, and you come outside and there's no accountability. There's... Views, they've they've taken money. all accountability off of the man, you know, like Yo. not 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 nothing about the rape case he was charged for, nothing about shit like putting money on people's head, nothing about getting certain things orchestrated, nothing about filming. Not none of his charges has been brought up. Just what they've done mm-hmm. to him, and what yeah. he's done to get out of that. Mm-hmm. Nothing like what you lot don't care it's, that. There, there was apparently a young girl involved in a case and that, you don't care what's happening. Whether he's done it or not, you lot just don't mm. care about the outcome of that. No. Mm. All mm. right, then. <laughs> All right, then. I hope you lot ain't got no daughters or little sisters or nothing, you know. Listen, man, it's, it's, it's wild. Like, all I would say is on every level, Takashi is a fucking superstar because he knows how to keep people talking about him he knows like even even you just saying what you just said as disgusting as it is we live in a day and age where it's you know some another thing to write about to get more clicks you understand what i'm saying like he's a he's so memeable he's so you I, you understand what i mean like yeah. i there's no on no level am i saying what we just discussed is okay you get what i'm saying right but he's just so he's a person who is so like it's on all aspects of his life, you can take something and it's going to add value to some sort of tabloid, to some sort of, you know, to another artist, to some sort of situation that's going on, to the internet in general. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. And it's it's mad. Like, you slightly, I mean, what do you think of, you know, you said academics has to be careful. Yeah. Um, what, do you, what do you think of sort of like their relationship going forward? How does that work? Because- Academics is going to be up his bum again. Hmm. It's beneficial mm. for him, isn't it? Mm. Clouting. But I mean, what what do they do to the you know the other side? Like essentially, what do they do? Do they pay them off? What what is it like? How how can how can Takashi Six Nine get out of this situation? Security twenty four seven. That's it. Apparently, the security mm. firm that he's using is ex special forces from different countries. Mm. Mercenaries, so, basically. Yeah. Mm. He's gonna have to, because mm. I, you've put someone away for for what ten years. That's that's probably the the lightest sentence out of all of them, which is shorty, I, I think. Mm. Or the no, there's one that's like four years or something like that. But other than that, it's ten up. You get me? Mm. That's ten up. You've stopped a family mm. from eating, or they get me like you've ruined the structure, and then they have to come home and readjust and. It might not be the same when they come home. You get me? Mm-hmm. They're going to miss that money and you on the internet talking the, the most. Yeah. 
It's a lot, man. I, yeah. What, what I think works in his benefit, yeah, is mm. we have this, this, this. Sorry, my guy. Minor. Apologies. We, you know how the camera does. Yeah, yeah, yeah we get it. It oh. happened to me on stream yesterday. But we, we have this, 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 these rules, yeah. That's it. You can't snitch. This is the first person in history to snitch, and <laughs> we're we're seeing it all fold, fold out, like unfold. This is history in the making, basically. So he's got that benefit. Like we're all trying to see what happens. It's something we've never ever witnessed ever. No pun intended. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, like it's like a it. it he's created like you know not musically, but just his impact on the game is like Tupac-esque. You get what I'm saying? Like, it cannot be forgotten. You get what I'm saying? And that's what I mean. It cannot be forgotten, bro. This is history, bro. It is history. You get it? It is history. Like, it cannot be forgotten. Like, it's, it's it, Tupac, you understand what I mean by Tupac-esque. You get what I'm saying? I don't mean like, oh, you're, you're doing great things for the scene. No, I mean, you've created a moment in fucking history that's going to go down in the history books of, you know, it, it just adds, you can, can you imagine the documentary about this brother's life? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It'd be crazy. It'd Yo, be crazy. There's, there's got to be films made about this dude. There has to be films I made swear, about I swear, I swear, um, 50 Cent bought the rights to one while he was Seriously? in jail. Yeah, I'm Seriously? sure I've seen that. Okay. So you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm still. Yeah, there's so much like, yeah, he's, he's going to be protected for a very long time now. For mm-hmm. a very long time, man. Um, Yeah, I, I you know, He's entertaining. I will be tuning into his lives. I will be too. Um, see what I've gone. Yeah. See how long yeah, he took his, his stuff for. How, yeah, yeah. One other question I wanted to ask you, yeah. We know that like, mm. hip hop was kind of birthed in New York, so they have a certain type of pride about them <laughs> and whatever else. Like, How yeah. do you feel <laughs> New York is going to respond? How do they respond to this? Like, what When their they- king is... When the king is when um, someone say you got you got artists like Casanova that's very prideful. You got artists like like I think Casanova and, and them man were beefing before, innit? Six nine were beefing mm-hmm. before. Mm. And it almost got Is that techie. when they shot up the Barclay the Barclay Centre, yeah? Yeah, yeah. It almost got uh-huh. techie. Uh-huh. So you got artists like Casanova, you got artists like French that just went out fifty. Mm. You got you got artists like Lil TJ, which is on a rampage right now. A Boogie, mm-hmm. mm. Bobby Schmurder and Rowdy Robert when they come out in December. You get me? That's, how is this? Yeah, movie, yeah. How, do you, how is New York going to respond to this? Listen, I think New York, the streets anyway, have already disowned him. I think you know what I mean. They can't. They won't condone that behavior. But but it's... he's beef. He's literally. Be- he's about to beef his whole city. You saying I'm the king of New York and I'm beefing everybody? Yeah. 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 And that's that's why he's the biggest superstar in the world, bro. But <laughs> he, what do you think's gonna happen, bro? Can I he do shows in the... New York? <laughs> How is this gonna bro, happen? I think I I don't know. You know, I just don't know. I don't know. I honestly, I'm the, le- the legit. I'm very interested. I am like I'm very interested. I like. The logistics around it are gonna have to be mental, yeah. For, and then furthermore, you have to respect the fact that New York is not necessarily all controlled by the police. You know, you get what I'm saying. And there are people who live in those boroughs, neighborhoods who don't want any trouble, and who have jobs at, let's say, a, a, a performance venue or something like that. You feel what I'm saying, yeah? It's too, I don't think he can perform in New York. I don't think so, man. I don't think it's safe. It's it's too much of a security. If I, if I was an investor, for me, keeping my investment safe, it's too much of a security risk. Do you know, you know what I'm saying? Do you know what's mad to me? Yeah? I'm just mm. deep in how many people he's pissed off. He's pissed off the people in, in, in Houston, like with Rap-A-Lot and, and <laughs> like Jay Prince and they get me a dead bad day. He's pissed off people in the West Coast, the Hoovers and them man there. He's pissed yeah. off people in Chicago. The whole of New York yeah. hate him. Brother, what can this guy do for <laughs> Where can he go? <laughs> Mexico, man. Me- Mexico, man. Mexico. He don't go Mexico. You see when everything opens back up and shows are yeah. allowed, then this is going to be so interesting. And we're going to find out what happens in the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. 
<laughs> don't know. Trust me. It's Listen, mad, man. <laughs> mad, man. Yo, um, yeah, we just sign off at this point, man. Yeah, me, like... Welcome back to the Chain Reaction Podcast. Not really welcome back. I'm saying goodbye, but thank you for tuning in. You get me? Man's been wily to the VI. We've got the man himself here. Walks is king, you done, no? His name is Lee to the VI, my order. But yeah, man, we out, It's father. Love for <laughs> tuning in. <laughs> Peace, man. <laughs>